Can I turn the inside one on? Yeah. Yeah! Now we can get Peyton in it. There he is. There you go. <laughs> Let's see it there. Maybe. There we go. Now then, we're finally back from South Dakota. I'm sure that video will be out before this one. I'll have to make sure it's out. And back to hunting with Dad. Um, like I said, that video is out. So if you want to go watch it, spoiler alert, we got two. Peyton got one. Buddy of ours from out there got one. Um, he was very gracious and let us pheasant hunt his land and uh, said uh, if we wanted to coyote hunt, we could, but we needed to take his son because he'd love to go. And so we took Kale with us and old dead eye dropped it first shot. First time I've seen that happen, I think. But anyway, we're back in North Carolina. Um, how long? We've been back a week. Yep. And got a call two or three days ago from a farmer saying that uh, he had, he said uh, he had some many coyotes down there. It was scaring him. He's had some cows get took out from him. Called and asked if we'd uh, take care of those for him. And then um, on mine and my dad's property, um, I was putting out some deer corn, actually. And, uh, yeah, I bait deer. I suck at deer hunting. That's why I coyote hunt all the time. <laughs> but uh, I was putting out some deer corn. And uh, a siren went down the road. And a bunch lit up. And then we started looking a little more because it's a spot we don't even coyote hunt anymore. Um, I think last year or two years ago, I can't remember, I killed six or seven bobcats off of uh the 30 acres and then i bought another 30 and we're gonna hunt that tonight so it should add up to be a good night is what i was getting to um what do you think no more head buster three yeah eight. big guy got his suppressor in got the banish 30 shout out silencer central and my main man andrew hit us up if you want a pretty sweet deal on a suppressor and a kit comes with a 22 suppressor those ain't in mine's on the way his banish 30s here and his 22s on the way yep. big diss to the atf hate y'all don't care who knows it <laughs> me and dad are still running the yankee hills don't give too much away we got to do that uh yeah gear gear drop yeah we got to do if we can all ever get together like i said me and Peyton went to Maine, and then Michigan. A week later, two weeks later after that, he went to Michigan. Um, then a week after that, me and him went to South Dakota, and then this weekend he's going to Caswell, uh, somewhere else in North Carolina where he deer hunts. Y'all go that far? Yeah, not it's, not it's Caswell up Beach. Yanceyville. Um, it's up top Virginia. Line. Yeah, Virginia um, line. Yeah. Um, and then the week after that. Um, me and dad are going to another part of uh, North Carolina for Thanksgiving weekend. Mm -hmm. So we'll get a gear drop or I don't know. What do you even call that? Like uh, outfit of the day, yeah. <laughs> coyote edition, yeah. but we're going to get that put together for everybody. Um, I reckon that's about it. Yeah. You know, let's, uh, let's get out here and see what we can. Yeah, let's pray and get to hunting. <clears throat> Dear Lord and most uh, gracious Heavenly Father, God, thank you for tonight. Thank you for, once again, just allowing us to be able to get out and enjoy what you've blessed us with where we live. God, we just pray that uh, you'd bless our hunt, that uh, you would bring some coyotes our way, and that you would uh, guide our shots and only let them only let them hit their intended targets. God, we just love you and thank you in advance. In Christ's name we ask it. Amen. Amen. Let's see what we can squall in.
Yeah, that's fine. Well, first stand was a bust, as you could see. I can't say that those cows ruined it because we've killed them with them doing the exact same thing, but it makes it awful tough to spot the hunt. But, of course, we get right on stand. My wife starts blowing up my phone. I finally answer it. She says, Hunter, there's a bobcat outside. And sure enough, I got her to send me a picture from our cameras. And there's a doggone bobcat right outside my back window. How many times have you been turkey hunting, though, and, and someone called and said, hey, there's one walking down the driveway? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Time. yeah. Yeah. They're right here at the house. Don't know why you went somewhere. Yeah. Just our luck. Or you come back and sled's got two piled up. Yeah. <laughs> him and a buddy. But. Anyway, we're off to our next spot. It's actually a feller me and dad have been doing some work for. So, uh, Joe, if you're watching this, thanks, man. But uh, it's on the back side of where we've killed a lot of coyotes, but it's hard to get them to come down off the hill. So we're hoping that this fixes it. Yeah, grab a second. Thanks, sir. We're hoping that this fixes it. So we're going to get out and get after them, I reckon. With this new piece of property, we were able to get up on top of the hill and uh, that way we wasn't having to try and call the coyotes past a herd of cows through two or three different fences and past a couple of houses to get them into the field for a good shot. So we was able to get up on top with them. And while it still took a hot minute to be able to work them in, um, it worked out just like we thought. Yeah, no, no. Don't let them get down that valley. Yeah. There, yep. There was one behind him. Huh? The different colors. Oh my gosh. Daylight's hey. breaking go. Nice job. <laughs> That's hey. awesome. Hey, buddy, you okay? Yeah. <laughs> it's a rough night. Dang. Now everybody's got a black one. That's what I was laying on the house. Yep. That's what I was telling you. They right call on. that the black color phase. Yeah. Dang, that's a pretty dog, dude. That's a pretty. That's a German dog. Shepherd. That's <laughs> the prettiest dog I've ever seen. I really thought that when I first hit him with the light. I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. Turn the cameras off. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that is pretty, pretty. Yeah, See, the gosh. cool thing is, <laughs> Peyton is our master skinner, and so we will get to relish this one forever I'll because be skinning this he'll have it skin out and put it up in a rug. That is awesome. Wow. That's a healthy looking coat, that too. That is. Let's see if it was. Male. Hmm. That was the female behind him, I guess. Yep. That's why she never turned and looked. Dang, what a pretty dog. Well, congratulations, Pay. <laughs> awesome. Oh, gosh. First one with the banish. Yeah, first suppressed coyote for awesome him. Awesome sounding thump. Yeah. That's a wicked suppressor. I can't wait till mine comes in now. And he got his first black dog. That's a mean looking dog. Wow. Wow. That 160 right there. You better take him, Hunter.
I think I see the second one on top of that hill out in the woods, just where he come from, I think. I thought I saw something flash. Ready? Yep. Hang on. I got left. I got left. Got him. <laughs> yeah, we kept hearing stuff like right here in the woods. Didn't know what it was. And <clears throat> then they pop up right there. Yeah, I didn't see that one. Good job, Dad. We've been getting lax on her. We ain't recorded in a hot minute. We've just been shooting, honestly, and forgetting to record. Well, we forgot to record even down there with those dogs. And we didn't, me and Peyton didn't walk down there with yours because we didn't know you was going to get here, I think. <laughs> <laughs> so, this video, I'm struggling. I'm sorry. But we got four in the truck now. Five. Uh, no. No, four. 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 My bad. We got one in the first spot, second spot we went to. Yeah. Another one in the third spot we went to. And then me and Peyton just doubled. That's almost a triple. Almost triple. The one kind of scraggled out on us and we caught it at the last second. Dad threw a shot at it. And it's still up in the air whether or not he hit it. That stuff's head high, just straight cuckle birds. You cannot make it through. So if it made it more than about 10 foot into the weeds, we don't know where it went. But anyway. Probably a miss. Is, might have been a miss. Yeah, we caught it late as it's leaving it. About 250, so. Running. Yeah, that's yeah. not a that's not a chip shot. So it, it very well could have been a miss. But still got four in the truck. And we've been working our spots from least expectancy to most expectancy. So, and one dog has left every stand we've called in coyotes. We're going to change that on this stand. This is mine and dad's property that we were talking about. There's actually probably two stands depending on how it works down here. Um, well, the ones that's left, though, they hadn't been with the main group. They've been True, yeah. stragglers, and honestly, we hadn't seen them until after yeah. the shot. That so. first spot, we never saw the dog. The second spot, we saw them about a thousand yards out, eight hundred something like that. And then the one never broke the tree line. The dad shot the other one, and then this last group, like we said, it was kind of late to the party. Yeah, but this is the spot we've seen all the poop and. It was a rabbit got tore up right behind a four-wheeler. Um, and where the uh, fire truck went down the road, and I heard them howl the other day. So we ain't hunted this spot in probably two years because we'd honestly just give up on it. So we'll see what we can get done. No, it wasn't me. It was them howling at us.
there's three down on our property at 380. Is that what you said? this morning or I guess this afternoon so it's pretty tough weather to get a hold of right now but hopefully we'll get a cold snap here soon and be able to get after them a little more yeah. see you on the next one